hello beautiful and amazing people welcome back to my youtube channel it's your favorite girl sapphire glow if you actually seen this face for the first time you're highly welcome to my channel please do me well by clicking on the red sign that says subscribe and also right after that the notification comes you can click on it so that you'll be the first to get notified whenever there's a new video up on my channel yes guys and so in today's video as you guys can see for those of you that have been following my channel for quite some time now you know that um, right now i'm at my place of where i'm doing my stage for the benefit of those that don't know what stage is stage is where i'm doing my internship and um in nigeria we call it um, industrial attachment yes that's where i am right now and um uh, <laughs> i'm so happy today why because today is going to be the end of my two weeks stage two weeks internship two weeks industrial attachment <laughs> i'm so very very happy because finally it has come to an end not the school itself but the um this internship itself is coming to an end today yeah so that's why i'm very very happy i'm tired guys i am uh, tired this job is not an easy job and i don't think i'm gonna be um, i don't know for now but if you ask me right now i would say this is not my kind of thing this is not what i would love to do you know as in for me i just think the work is stressful working in the hotel and um, being a housekeeper because that's basically for those of you that don't doesn't even know why i'm doing it is because um that's the inter sorry that's the school that i'm going for i'm going for a professional um course in hotel and um this is part of it part of the um school work um that you have to do this part <laughs> my colleague my this woman she's so funny see her behind very funny woman. so anyways guys as i was saying um so um yeah this is part of the school school work that you have to go for internship for two weeks and that's um basically why i'm doing it and this is the end of it like i said from the onset um other of my colleagues are in different hotels around my city here yeah, you understand because we're actually 12 in my class and um everybody's scattered all over uh because you have to get a place for yourself to go do the internship so this is where i am i'm supposed to be i'm here with my, actually with my colleague one other guy but so far the guy has not been coming um for this week he has only come once this week and today's the last day today's friday the last day he has only come once which was on tuesday that was the only time he has come and, and that tuesday that he came he was actually telling me that um he's gonna stop because this is not what is used to he doesn't like this um school that he's coming to because this is not the kind of job that he does you understand um he has always been working in the hotel section uh sorry not hotel in the restaurant section where he serves and you know now he serves and he gets tip all the time so i think he prefers that to this um housekeeping um professional course that we are doing housekeeping hotel you know this hotel course that we are doing anyways that's that's about my colleague that has not been coming to he actually told me he's going to stop and i think that's why he stopped but my teacher actually came today because um since the beginning of this course i of this uh, training i i forgot to collect the papers that you know like um i don't know how i'm going to put it okay there's a paper that um, from the school that the hotel people are supposed to be signing for you every day that you attended that they came you know to work so i didn't collect it before i started and uh, i've been trying to reach i've been talking to my teacher she keeps telling me she kept on telling me she will come today come to me so finally they spoke with her on wednesday so she promised them she's going to come definitely she's going to come today to bring the paper for them so finally she did she was here this morning around 10 and then we finalized finalized that aspect you know i i, I signed and then the uh, housekeeping woman you know in charge she, she signed also she signed all the all through the week and my teacher was kind of surprised that 
have been coming all through for these two weeks you know and she was trying to tell the woman that a lot of people during the last year said a lot of people stopped you know they said they couldn't continue that the work is difficult to understand you know she was expecting me to like you know maybe one day i didn't come and i said i came i've been coming for the past this is the 14th day now you know which is two weeks yeah i've been coming i never missed a day so she was like oh that's good because a lot of people don't usually complete the um the training in the start just in the internship you know so i signed and the woman signed and we gave her back the papers so that's that for this stage and um, that's why i said i'm very happy that it's coming to an end i am guys i'm really tired yesterday i got home and i slept like i felt like they used wood mm? you know this wood firewood to beat on my body because yesterday the work was non-stop only of course when we went for break the 12 o'clock break we had a lot a lot of um rooms to clean yesterday i and the woman that worked yesterday and she doesn't understand english the one i'm working with today understands english so sometimes it's i really don't feel bored while working with this one but with the other one i feel kind of bored because she just keeps speaking french and i don't understand but of course this one was actually telling my teacher today that uh, um that i'm okay that i'm good with the job you understand i do whatever they ask me to do you know i can clean the rooms so i can arrange it and all of that stuff you know, I think she gave her a good report about my um, my welfare so far in this place. So, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a rundown of how these two weeks have been in this place. Uh, should I? If you guys start in now, uh, if I really enjoyed um, doing this stage here, I would say yes and no. Yes, in the sense that... Um, of course someone is learning you understand you're experiencing a new thing you know all through my life i have not should i say i've not worked okay i worked in nigeria and uh, but i worked for a very short time after my youth service you know the normal youth service i served in abuja i i worked did the um normal one year youth service or whatever that you do i served in mitama in a private company in mitama and after that i relocated back to my base in Lagos and um, in Lagos I just decided to go into business self-employed I did my I started my woman business you know because I I like to do business that's what I've been doing that's what I've been doing right from secondary school I buy things and you know I sell even when I was in university I go to buy jewelry from Abuja Gold and come back to school to sell so I've been like self-employed I like working for my own money I don't like answering people sir I'm if you guys get what I mean. <laughs> so that's the spirit that still led me to after my youth service I went back to Lagos and I opened up my shop. I was doing the woman business. I had a wine shop, a very big wine shop in Lagos. So yeah and then of course somebody um offered me a job um opportunity. I went and I worked but guys I didn't work for more than I think the third month I had to quit. I got tired. That's just my own person. I got tired and I stopped and uh, just faced my business. Yeah, until I came to Europe. You understand? I was doing my woman business. So that's why I said I've not really worked. If you ask me, you know. So those are the times that I worked in Nigeria before I, I relocated abroad uh, to Europe. So guys, uh, so and since I came to Europe, I've been doing shipping. I went into this shipping business, buying of cars and the buses and, you know, loading it up and sending it down to Africa and then they sell, they send me my money, you know. I've just been that kind of business-oriented person, not this working class person. So, right now that I'm here in France and I got my documents, you know, they'll be forcing you to go look for a job and all of that stuff. If you don't want to go to, jo um, to look for a job, you have to go work. You understand yeah sorry you have to go to school that was why i went to the language school and yet this my head cannot take the language you understand i don't know why i cannot assim assimilate the language you know the french language i don't know why my teacher i even got my last result for the last school that i went in <laughs> you guys cannot believe the result the uh what is it called of the woman the observation and uh, uh what what would i call it uh, the report of the woman concerning my um my progress in school and 
how everything went that last school that i went to i went to that school last year from september till second of february you know so the, i finally got the result yesterday and when i translated it you guys will not believe what that woman wrote in that my result saying i i i don't have interest in learning the language and these white people <laughs> somebody has to be careful with them and don't tell them your secret because i remember when i came when i started that school i thought i was talking to a human being i told her that uh, because of the how difficult the language is for me to understand that i would at the end of the day you know at the long run i'm going to finally leave for, for, for you know france and probably go to london or go to germany or go back to go back to germany or go to london or just find a way to go to an english-speaking country share. Do you guys know that that thing that I told that when we started school in September, that woman wrote it in the report of the results that I don't have interest to learn the language because I have the mind of, you know, relocating out of France. That was the end of that result, the report that she wrote after my results. And, but anyways, I got 73 out of 100, you know, for everything, assessment and everything. I got 73 out of 100. And then she also wrote that, um, what did that woman even write again? She said, I am not... Um, um, I have forgotten what she wrote again, but I got 73. She said for the communication, I got uh, 13 over 25. I will just maybe in the next video, I'm just gonna put up the results there and you know let you guys see what this woman wrote. How in her So that was, and she said, um, she doesn't think, uh, I remember this one. She said she doesn't think I'm gonna get, um, because of the way. I don't have interest in learning the language and um, I don't even want to learn it then it will be difficult for me to get gain employment in the in the market you understand to gain to gain an employment in the outside world and here I am not even up to two weeks after I stopped that school I got this um what is it called um this school that I'm going to now this uh, professional school that I'm going to now it's not even language school this is professional course that I'm doing that I'm going to get the certificate and present it anywhere that you know that I have uh, I've already done a course in hotel in hotel you understand so I can get a job in any hotel you understand I mean I see the result that that woman wrote that uh, this one cannot I'm not this one a big I human being I'm love it I'm beautiful I'm wonderfully made in the image of God anywhere I put my hands anything I put my hands it shall prosper and anything I do it shall flourish and um, lines are falling onto me on pleasant places I'm not going to condemn myself I'm not going to call myself this one this special baby of God <laughs> got this professional course space just barely two weeks that i left that other language school and here i am i'm the only one in the class like you guys know that I do not understand french and here i am doing it do you understand is it not good it can only be good yeah so guys i don't want this video to be too long it's getting long already i just wanted you guys to know what's up with me with my um, internship my stage call it stage in france and um yeah we're on break now i decided to just quickly make this video i'm taking my coffee these people are nice they allow you to take their coffee from their machine and each of this cup can you imagine how small this cup is it's too evil and a day i can take like five <laughs> for free they normally sell their water for two evil and they give me they give me every day one bottle every day i can take what i want the coffee the water and this i drink like five six cup of coffee every day so they're nice people they are nice <laughs> The nice people so far so yeah so guys that's all for uh this video i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and i hope you guys really enjoyed listening to me and i'll definitely see you all on the next um video yes so i'm happy i'm finishing today like i said and uh, on monday we'll be going back to class school starts again and then the next stage the next internship is for me i think may 22 i'll let you guys know shy my come and subsequent videos i'll let you guys know so yeah this is the end of this video and guys do have a lovely 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 afternoon and i'll talk to you guys i'll see you all on the next one bye for me too